Star Plus World. Hey guys, if you guys wanted to know what, where I've been, I've been uh, I've been out here in Orlando, Florida, looking for work, and this things has been kind of tough for me, you guys. But anyways, uh, this will be the last plush movie until I can get myself situated. So um, I'm gonna have to give myself at least a month to get myself situated. I have ridiculous bills to pay, and I kind of got this job at the last minute when when you know rent day is kind of kind of next door. So anyways, so I'm gonna. Uh, show you guys this plush movie you know and um yeah i think it's been kind of tough for me but anyways uh i'm not going to be able to check my youtube analytics my tiktok stuff because uh my phone's messed up right now uh, i can't get a new one until until i start working so i hope you guys enjoy this plush movie this is going to be the last one you guys can see until i get myself situated out here there you go moses Thanks, Sonic. Congratulations on your first job in Florida, man. Ooh, thank you very much. I should have got me a glass. <laughs> yeah. So that's the feel. <sighs> like nothing's changed. Now look, Moses. I didn't come over here to to listen to your complaint and everything. Now you need to understand something. It's really hard to to find work out here in Florida. I understand Sonic. Okay? Now, um, yeah, man, the other reason why I came here is the same that I'm proud of you, man. It's it's really hard <laughs> to make a living out here if you don't have no work or have no job. <sighs> now, um, yeah, man, just, yeah, enjoy your little, what is that? Is it, you're the one that got it for me. What is it? It's a, oh, some sort of Fiji calorie drink. Oh. Oh, that's good, man. Please tell me you got another one. Nah, I think that's the only one I got. Knuckles drunk the other one earlier. <sighs> Come on, man. He sucks. I never had no carbureted apple juice. You never had apple cider? Oh yeah, yeah I've had I've, I've had that. Okay. <laughs> We're all proud of you, Moses. Especially Amy, even though she isn't here. Oh, Lola called me the other day. Are you serious? Yeah. I thought the whole thing with me and her was over, but... I did tell her that me and Sally was dating. Oh, how does she feel about that? No, she, she, it, it, she wasn't sad or anything or uh, upset. She was she was happy for me. Oh, she was. Did she get back together with uh, Bugs? Nah, she's single right now. She said that she doesn't want to date anyone right now. Oh, that's good. She doesn't need to be dating anyone right now. Yeah, you're probably right. But again, Moses, I am proud of you. Uh, I'm about to go in the other room and play some video games. All right, Sonic. Uh, thanks for the drink. It's all good, man. What you girls talking about over here? You talking about our cow bread and his new job? Oh, really? Yeah, congratulations, Moses. Thanks, Mavis. Yeah, we're real proud of you, Moses. It's really hard looking for work out here. Uh, we should have told you that before you left, but we didn't want to. Uh, we didn't want you to be disappointed. We we kind of wanted you to figure that out on your own. Yeah, uh, well. Thanks. A lot. Um, Moses. No. Penelope. What? what? What is it, girls? She wants to ask you something. What is it? We wanted to ask you about that, um, that line you've been seeing in your dreams. Oh. Okay. It's... Here's the thing with the lion. Look, a lot of people are not going to understand this because... A lot of people aren't spiritual. I don't think it's something we should talk about on YouTube. This is the perfect place to talk about those things, Moses. Yeah, Moses, tell us. 
Okay, well, the first dream I had about the, the, with the lion is when, I don't know, I was, I was walking down the street and then I ran into this guy and then the, the lion came out of nowhere. Uh, and he was talking about, um, you ran into your apartment. This is the, the apartment back in here, California? Yeah, I ran into the apartment that the lion was chasing me. And then I ran into the shower. And me and my old roommate, we had like a, like a shower door. Uh -huh. And before I ran into the uh, ran into the shower, the the lion scratched me. What? Yeah, scratched me in my arm. And then after that, the lion just disappeared. And just a few days later, uh, the lion came back again. You're kidding me? Yeah, I had a dream last night that I went. I was I was back in my dad's house. Oh no, not your dad's house. Yeah, and my mom was in the backyard. Your mom? Yeah. I went up there and I was asking her about one of my external hard drives and out of nowhere the lion started sprinting towards me. What's with the lion? Oh no. Now um I took a snapshot of uh my mom looked it up for me. Um there's a reason why I've been seeing a lion in the dream. Now for those who's watching this video, I'm gonna show you guys a snapshot of um the Wikipedia research that uh, me and my mom found on the internet so you guys can see it or maybe I'll show it um, to you guys before the video starts hey, that's crazy Moses <laughs> yeah Moses that's that's like some spiritual that's some spiritual stuff well maybe it's maybe the lie is the reason why you got the job Moses now I'm not. Now I'm not finished about uh, uh, talking about the dream. Now, after the the lion sprint toward me, that's when I woke up. Well, I'll try to woke, try to wake up. You try to wake up. I was paralyzed in bed. Oh, sleep paralysis. So you had sleep paralysis after the dream? That's two cycles. Yeah. And guess what happened? What? The reason why I couldn't move in bed is because the lion's paws was holding my hips. You've got to be kidding me. I'm not, I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> he was he was holding on to you. He, he, I don't know what that means. Well, there's a reason for everything, Moses. Were you scared? No, I, I wasn't scared because I know he wasn't going to hurt me. I don't... I don't feel uncomfortable when the when this lion is around. It's, I think it's a good thing, not a bad thing. Well, maybe it's a good thing. Maybe it's a some sort of spirit. Maybe this. Well, I've had weird dreams like that too. Um, wasn't a lion though. <laughs> what was yours? You don't want to know. <laughs> well, anyways, um, Moses, are you hungry? I got a hamburger when I, uh, before I came home. Oh, well, we'll have to feed you. Alright, so, I guess we're going to get going. Yeah. Yeah. You, you okay, Graham? Yeah, I'm fine. Then. Sonic, where did you come from? I snuck in here. You're so nosy. <laughs> Anyways. Well, Sonic, we'll see you later. Alright. Uh, me and Mavis and Vanellope, we are going to the steakhouse down the street. Are you sure you're not hungry, Mosley? How about this? No, I'll be fine. Okay. We'll hit Amy a text later and let, let, let her know how you're doing. That's still your wife. You should be calling her, Moses. I'll try to call her tonight and I'll let her know that I'm, I got a new job. Okay. <sighs> no more crazy dreams, Moses. It wasn't great. Well, the way you explained it was kind of crazy in the first one. Yeah, Moses. Um, um, if you see that lion again, uh, you know what? Write it down, Moses. You should write a story about that, or do a YouTube video about it. Oh, well, okay. All right. <laughs> All right, we gotta get going, Moses. All right. <sighs> Moses, how do you use the stupid lock? It's already unlocked. No, it's not. Oh. Twist it. Okay. And then you just open the door. 
And it's bright out here. It's like 2,000 degrees. Wait, Mavis, are you not supposed to be in the light? Oh my god. Well, do you have any sunglasses? Alright, let me go see if I have some. I knew I should have got Mavis some sunglasses before we came over here. Anyways, you guys, we want to tell you guys that we all have a spiritual animal. And Moses found his before he moved out here to Orlando, Florida. Uh, I think that the lion, it symbols courage. And Moses, he, he second guesses himself. He doubts himself a lot. And so I just think that this, uh, this lion spirit was, was here to, you know, push him in the right direction. The way he explained uh, the dream to us, like it seemed like that's that was a pretty that was pretty much it. But anyways, you guys, um, we gotta get going. Uh, Moses is gonna be gone for a little while, so he will be working on any YouTube videos, maybe TikTok. But uh, yeah, he's gonna have to get his his stuff together and pay these ridiculous bills because yeah, he was down to the last few pennies before he found a new job. And I'll talk to you guys later.